Have you ever played a tabletop RPG about surviving and overcoming capitalism on a gargantuan space station? Tomorrow on Revelation 3 is a brilliant and thought-provoking game designed by Dominique Dickey and CJ Linton. In this game, your characters and thousands of others live on a station called Revelation 3, with decks divided by intense stratification. There's an overview of each deck, starting with deck A and ending with deck F. Reading about these decks feels like a gut punch as you realize just how different they are. For example, Deck A is reserved for the station's board and junior administrators. It's described as having enormous windows giving a view of the stars, and it has a ton of recreational facilities, including a zoo and large shopping mall. Meanwhile, Deck E is home to agricultural workers. Most of them are poorly compensated and have inherited debt, and their residences are just individual capsule bedrooms that are approximately three square meters a person. In this game, your characters recognize the glaring inequalities on Revelation 3 and are doing what they can to fight against them. Character creation is super easy. First, you pick a profession, which determines which deck you work on and which deck you live on. Each of these backgrounds has a couple of unique traits. For example, if you choose child care worker, you get a trait called meddling kids. Once per scene, you can declare a fact about the deck you're employed on that you overheard from the children you take care of. Then you answer the three questions at the bottom of the page. For example, the healthcare worker has a question that is, when and how did you first become aware of the healthcare inequalities on the station? Gameplay involves going on missions to improve the quality of life on the station. These missions might involve talking to NPCs, smuggling goods, or exposing corruption, among other things. There are four stats, mental, physical, social, and technological. When you run into an obstacle, you make a skill check, rolling a 10-sided dice and using one of your four skills. There's a lot of awesome sections in this book, including one on notable NPCs, the economics and culture on the ship, and one on safe and enjoyable gameplay. Also, if this sounds like fun but you don't know how to get started, there are four mission modules at the back of the book that you can pull from. My favorite of these is Alphabetical Reorder by Jabari Weathers, in which you're basically trying to provide the infrastructure for the station's internet on all lower decks. Tomorrow on Revelation 3 is a smart game with an important message, and I highly suggest picking up a copy for yourself.